I have had this preloaded, so hopefully this should be better. There we go. Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, last one was a bit short because I did stream late. Uh, that's why I'm back to around 1 o'clock. Um, not had any distractions, just pretty much straight on with it. Uh, I'll go for an hour and a half, two hours maybe. I'm off work tomorrow, thank God, because today was pretty hectic, uh, to say the least. Uh, very eventful. Um, yes, uh, so in the last one, just in case you haven't watched it, I would not watch this for now, because uh, I'm going to basically explain what happened in the last one. Turns out Arthur has tuberculosis and is on death's door, essentially. Um, so it's on borrowed time. Uh, because there's a bit where you go into town and basically you start coughing. Basically, you as you come back, you start coughing quite a bit, and then it basically gets worse to the point you fall off the horse. You're passing out. Guide guides you to the doctor. He's like, "Oh yeah, you got TB." Uh, gives you like a dose that helps you for a bit, but basically you're sick, so you have to be taking care of your health on a constant basis. Um, and yeah, uh, and then also. We found this area, took care of all the people from there, helped another lady out, took her back home, ran into Mrs. Downs, whoever that is. I think she was a former camp member. Like I said, I should have probably looked it up, but I didn't. Um, and then uh, Molly conf was drunk, confessed to ratting us out to uh, Pinkerton and the detectives. Dutch wanted to have her killed. We tried to calm the situation, and then... I can't remember what her name is, but the female leader essentially shot her and said, we don't deal with traitors. So she's just as bad as Dutch. So whether they're both on the decline, who knows. Um, but yeah. Uh, sorry, I'm just finally sharing to socials. Uh, I'm terrible at multitasking. Uh, So I won't be too long. Yeah, uh, so we're at this camp where it's the tension is very high. Obviously, we've lost a good amount of people. Um, could be on the way to losing more. Um, so yeah, we'll just see what happens in this one. Um, <laughs> There we go. So yeah. Um, right, I will be ready to be started. Oh, I gained a new follower. I'm on 52 followers now. Thank you to whoever that was that followed me. Uh, I didn't get the notification for it, but I shall have to look at it at some point. So, where's good old awesome was back there? Um... Yeah, CD, we we found where John is as well. Um, so we're going to go rescue him from the prison. Uh, oh, there we go. It's just updating me on my screenshot. Um, so, yeah. Um, so, yeah, we used a high air balloon. Unfortunately, the guy got shot. So that's another person died in our hands. Susan? Someone smashed the box. What box? The money box. We'd had that for so many years. Why did they smash it? Well, I don't know. Look at this place. All divided. Everyone anxious and at each other's throats. She's the one that shot Molly. I'm heartbroken. Yeah, me too. <laughs> me too. Okay. Um. Right. Who's... Oh, this is Dutch's also. Oh, Jesus! Ow! Be easy there. Jesus Christ! Oh, this is, no, this is my other horse, isn't it? No, it's not. You fucking kicked me, you dick! Right, my health is recover. There, there. 
Shush. Shut the fuck. Alright, don't walk behind it again. As it will just kick me. Horson, you're not gonna kick me, are you? How are you, boy? There you go. Okay. Yeah, uh, so we used the hot air balloon to find where John was. Basically, he's been used in the fields. Um, so, yeah, we're going to go rescue him. Uh, what's that? The pod strauss. Oh, that's the deck like stuff, isn't it? Still got some of the old ones to do. Oh, that's six. Oh, that means I missed out on five. So, I don't know if all the side missions are going to count now. Hopefully, once I finish the story... It will go, uh... Oh, here's some missions that you didn't do, so we've activated them for you. Yeah. Like, that's normally why I try to do side missions and stuff sometimes, it's just so I don't miss anything. Uh, I might have to do that on just like a separate playthrough or something. Or, like, unless it is nice enough and goes, Oh, by the way, here's all the missions you didn't do. They're now available to you anytime. I'll have to wait and see. But uh, we're on our way to go find Sadie. Yeah. Um. Yeah, like I said. Uh, you okay, buddy? This don't look good, boy. Yeah, have a. Hey, hey, da, da, da. I ate something hey, bad, Mr. Drink up. Real bad. It's... Oh. 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 You okay? Oh, thank you. Reckon I was done for there. What'd you eat? Oh. 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 Had a bite of that plant over there and it hit my guts like a freight train. Why are you eating plants? Oh. It's that little one over there with the pink flowers. I'd stay well clear of that, if I was you. Yeah, I think you've sold me on that plan. Tell me about it. What is it? Oleander Sage. Oleander is a poisonous herb. You think you have to apply poison to weapons like that. Ah! Okay. Right, we we'll eat it, because I'm not stupid. Well, I am. But... Interesting. Well, that's safety guy. So. Oh, there's something dead there. There's a, there's a little paw symbol. Oh, it's a little jet rabbit. Go me, uh. Yoink! Come on, boy. Yeah, um... Alright, yep. what's that? We've got sidetracked there. Uh, yeah, so we're gonna go rescue John. Uh, apparently we're like 59% of the way through the story or something like that, it said. Or 50% of the way through. But I don't know if that's story completion or game completion. If it's story, then we've got another 15 streams or so to go. Um... And then, don't know what to stream after that. Like, I'm still in the process of trying to figure out. I was thinking, tomorrow on my day off, but I may have other plans. Uh, I'm maybe streaming SpongeBob Truth or Square for an hour and a half, if I can stream a 360 game. Because I got one final achievement to get in that, and I glitched myself out of it in my main playthrough, so I'm having to play through it a second time. So, that's always fun. Way to go, I think. Yeah. Is it a snake? What was that? Oh, 
was nearby. How's that? Let's skin the snake. There we go. I got it, boy. Yep. Easy, boy. Oh, it's going all mucky now. Coming with us to collect your husband? I... Abigail, you ain't coming. That's the end of the matter. See, there you heard him. Now let's go. But but nothing. It'll be quicker and easier with just the two of us. Plus, John will be calmer without worrying about you. Ain't complicated. Well, why well, ain't the crime sort? But I'm real grateful. Yeah, we know you are. We'll bring him back to you. Thank you. Thank you both. I was able to fucking gun it at them. By she hopefully gave us a bit of cover to move in close enough so, to find a spot. I look you know what? I really this like Sadie. Day, Sa like Sadie is so like apart from the last stream where she went off to try and kill more interesters. She was very logical there. She said she like, no, we're not taking you, it'll be easier with the two of us, and it'll be easy to get John out without having to worry about you all the time. Because that's pretty much what the problem would be. Is Basically, they'll be so looking out for each other. One of them's gonna get okay, shot. Over. I'm very glad I didn't have to row all that then. <gasps> We're good? Uh, yeah, just silent. Head for that watchtower. It's still okay. cool. Stay low. I do like the crouch run. Oh, we're up there. Oh, yeah. you with him. Okay. I'll follow you up. Okay. Okay. Oh, Come on up. Hey, I think I see him. There's a group in front of that barn, just to our right. Ah, uh, yeah. I see two guards. Okay, take them out, and let's go get our boy. Okay. I can't see anything with you. Sorry. Standing there. I don't know. Oh, is the sun slowly kind of like if I'm wearing two warm clothes? 
Come on, Arthur. Let's keep moving. Where is he? You see him? No. You. Mister. You know John Marsden? I, he ain't... He ain't working today. Put the gun down, lady. No. Oh, God. Volcanic pistol. You put the gun down. Now. Where's John Marston? He ain't in the work he dealt today. Okay, well, I guess we'll go and get him together. Try anything, I'll blow your damn head off. You clear on that? Yes, very clear. Oh, no, you don't. You apologize to the lady for pointing a gun at her. Excuse me? I said apologize. <laughs> man is I'm sorry, bitch. man. Ain't no harm done. So, where do we go? Towards the entrance, I guess. And who's in charge of this fine establishment? Jameson, sir. Jameson who? No, Mr. Jameson. Heston Jameson. Uh, is he a nice fella? Uh... He's been quite an exacting boss at times. I look forward to meeting him. They're... They're not gonna let you do this. Well, that's gonna be up to you, my friend. I'd say that was quite a nice conversation, because I'm going hostage. <laughs> oh, God. So, you a popular employee, my friend? Not especially. Well, I guess we're about to find out. Come on, march him straight up to the front gate. You better hope someone in there actually gives a damn about this fool. Guess we'll see. We're gonna have to shoot our way out of here regardless. Friend, be cool now. Just do as I say. Put the weapons down now. Jameson! Is Jameson in? He's in South Denise. They got Milliken. Got him and gonna kill him. Unless you bring me John Marston right now. Got one minute. I'm counting. One, two, three. Uh, uh, Milliken, is it? Yes, sir. Will you count for me? I got talking to do. Uh, yes, sir. Of course, sir. <clears throat> From one or four? Oh, sir? very funny. Now, we must be at 11 by now. 11, 12, 13, uh, faster. 14, 15. Six, six, six. Now hurry up! Eighteen, well, this poor fool's gonna get his brain shot out and over what? For nothing. Hey, Milliken, don't stop counting. I can't hear you. Now hurry up and bring that asshole out here, you bastards! Come on! Don't cry, buddy. I don't wanna die. Yeah, I know, I know. Hey, hey, John. Hello, you too. Now, no funny business. Well, Mr. Medican here will stop crying once and for all. Okay. Today's your lucky day. Let's go. Run. Let's clear these and make a run for it. You forgot how to use that gun. I'm just going to switch to this. That guy's much easier. I was gonna say, I need some help.
I'm having fun killing all these people from a distance. Right, run. I'll get my ass kicked here. Coming here, don't look too friendly. We best get out of here. Come on, boss. <laughs> Let's move. I'll roll. You shoot. Seriously? Let me. You, you're a better shot. All right, fine. You just relax and enjoy yourself, John. Leave the real work to them as can still handle it. Thanks. Oh, I got a guy from a distance away there. That's great. I think I liked you better when you was all trussed up like a prize chicken. No doubt. Oh, hurry up. They're gonna be on our tails soon enough if you boys keep wasting time. Oh, that's us told them. Uh, hey, Arthur. Thank you. Don't mention it. Let's go. We should get out of here quick before the law gets wind of this. So what the hell happened in San Denis? Is Abigail all right? She's fine. Jack is too. She managed to escape when they got to Hosea. Hosea? That still don't seem real somehow. All them years. Arthur. He was like... Like family. Yeah. Yeah, we lost young Lenny too. No. What a goddamn mess. And then we... What about the, the money? Lost somewhere at the bottom of the ocean. What? How the hell did that happen? We hit on a boat. The only way out of there. The boat went down in a storm, and we ended up stranded on an island somewhere near Cuba. Cuba? Wait. You're gonna have to tell me all this again. It's a long story, but things ain't been good, John. <laughs> You're telling me. We're holed up now in the mountains to the north, near Rono Ridge, some caves there. The Pinkertons caught up with us again, and we had to move. Yeah, seems Molly ratted us out, the bitch. So she's dead, too. Jesus. Maybe you should have just left me to hang. And... Uh, I should warn you, Dutch didn't want us breaking you out. Said it wasn't the right time, so... Might not be the hero's welcome you're imagining. So much for no man left behind. I can't stop thinking about this. In the bank, when they grabbed me, he saw it. Felt almost like he had a, a moment to do something and didn't. Dutch ain't himself right now. Or... Maybe he just ain't who we thought he was. Guess we don't need to worry about who's his favorite no more. <laughs> Guess not. 
I'm very interested to see where this whole Dutch thing goes. Do you know what? Still never looked at the Red Dungeon story to see who's left in that. But maybe I don't want to. Maybe that's something, maybe subconsciously I'm stopping myself from looking. Just in case it says, oh, John has to go kill these people. Because I genuinely cannot remember anyone. You brought him back to me. We told you we would. John! What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, partner. I meant I hadn't sent for you yet. I will. But I said that. Yeah, I know what you said. I felt different. Is that so? Yes. And when Spring and John brings the law down on all of us, what then, Arthur? Well, I guess we'll have another fight on our hands. Loyalty, Arthur, it ain't. I had a goddamn plan! John. John. You are my brother. You are my son. I was coming for you. They... They was talking of hanging me, Dutch. They was talking. They was talking. And now they may come and hang us all. Oh, sorry. I was miles away, thinking of, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Dutch said to tell you he and Mike have gone to Annisburg. Something about Mr. Cornwall. Cornwall. Oh. Okay. Thanks, Mary Beth. All right, bronze. Oh, well. Okay. Um, right, is there a shaving kit here? There is, isn't there? Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, we ain't done yet, Abigail. Dutch seems... To have lost his mind? I know. Just be careful. I don't have to be careful. I... I have you as a friend. No. Oh. Uh, right, first things first, I'm trimming this beard down. Oh, yep, I could do it taking some out. God, look at that. Take a long. There we go, that's how I do long. Hey, it's still fine.
those who deserve it always seeking reason enough for judging. Problem is, I ain't sure he cares who he's fighting no more. <coughs> Mr. Morgan, you don't look very well. Uh, I'm not, Reverend. <coughs> I fear I'm pretty sick. I'm so sorry. You seem well, on the other hand. Yes, sir. I've stopped all that silly business. Mm -hmm. I think I'm okay. Well, that's wonderful news. <laughs> How? I don't know. I met a Catholic lady, a nun, and we prayed, and it was lifted. The curse was lifted. Good. I can't believe it. Really, I can't. All those years I wasted. Arthur, you'll get what's coming to you. If the Pinkertons don't kill us, your food will. I'm doing my best here. Talk shit to me, I'm gonna talk shit back to you. Right, what's the next mission we've got? Ah, oh, it's a Micah mission. Okay. We're wanted dead or alive in this whole area, so I'm gonna be interested to see what happens here. Yeah. Oh, let us arrive you. Turn to the camp to read it. Okay, I'm going back. Bad horse shits in camp, they'll be hell to pay. Oh. It'll be fine. Right, is this another, uh, Mary mission? Wait, the letter is there, I just can't access it. Primary, you just grease your hair. There we go, it's back later. Dear sir, you were once very kind to Bo and myself, and it pains me to ask you to show us further kindness. But I have nowhere else to turn, and nobody else upon whom I can impose. I will, of course, pay you handsomely for oh, your service. Oh, it's these two. My family have turned quite mad and are threatening to send me away to stop my work, which they say is disgracing them. As if their history of absolute moral depravity, utter debauchery, and perpetual drunkenness did not disgrace them enough. I must escape, yet I am kept prisoner here. Can you help? Most days I am to be found at the cabins on the plantation. The main house and all it stood for are thankfully no more. Yours faithfully, Penelope Braithwaite. Yes, Kemi Penelope. Right. So where am I going for that one? Well, that's going to be really far away, isn't it? There! Jesus! Right. So what? If fast travel is an option? Fucking fast traveling. Where's the map? Arthur. Say, I'm not riding all the way there. You can fast travel there, for God's sake.
There you go. I'm now at my minimum weight. Oh, I should probably eat more then. Hello, mister. Hello. Oh, oh, you came. You came. You finally came. I came. Oh, thank you. Thank you, you lovely, lovely man. Uh, calm down, miss. Oh, come on, let's go. We ain't got a minute to lose. They killed her. They killed Miss Calhoun. All she wanted was a better lot for women, and they killed her, those pigs. Who killed her? I don't know. My cousins, probably, or or bows. Well, you met them. They are animals. Not even animals. Monsters. Monsters. If God had lost all his powers of imagination. Can you... Can you please take me to the train station? Bo will be waiting. Bo? Why couldn't he come rescue you? Well... If they saw me and him together, they'd lynch him and send me off to a nunnery. Or maybe they'd lynch us both, I ain't quite sure. They do so love hanging folk. Where are you heading? Up to Boston. Good. Yeah, I like you up there. Come on. Let's go. Of course. Have I done the previous fall before? I genuinely can't remember. Go ahead. I'm in your hands. Just get me to Rhodes Railway Station. Okay, let's try and get you a train. Oh God, I was just waiting at the station in the hope you'll show up, or I'll show up to help you show up. He goes to there every day he can, makes up some excuse or other. I said he would see me there one day soon, and today he will. God willing. Well, well. If he's there, that's true love, all right. I've hardly seen him since the rally. They watched me so carefully, and he's waited, or so his letters say. Our families won't let us out. And then all that business with Aunt Catherine and my cousins. Oh, you saw the house. And then Lee Gray and those boys killed. So much bloodshed. I, you'd think this could be a new beginning, but everyone left alive. They're even more angry. Maybe anger's a complicated thing to let go of. Something good has to come out of this awful, awful feud. That's what I've been hoping. Bo and yeah. I have to be better. Our families were here for years and years. Sometimes I feel like we can't just leave death and, and pain and ruination behind us. Plenty before you have. Plenty will again. But, yeah. As far as it goes, get out, don't look back, make something decent of your lives. He's a good man, isn't he, Bo? There are worse. He's kind, and he's caring, and he's strong. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to laugh. <laughs> strong he's isn't. a lot of things, but... <laughs> Not strong like you, but strong enough to stand up to his family. There he is! Oh, it's him! Will you ride on the train with us a little, just to the first stop? Fine. Who are you? Why am I focused on you? I can't even imagine what he's got down. Oh, that's Bo, isn't it? Gee. Are you coming, miss? You came! <laughs> you came! At last, you came! Oh, Bo, my sweet... My best of men. <laughs> oh, I'm hardly a man at all. But I love you, Penelope Braithwaite. <sighs> Sir, how can we ever repay your kindness? Mm, some of them jewels would do just fine. Bo, Arthur's gonna join us. I think we need the support. Please, could you buy the tickets, dear Mr. Morgan? We, we can't chance being seen. Sure. Thank you. 
We'll meet you on the platform. Hello. Can I have three tickets to San Denis, please, sir? Of course. Oh, hello, sir. Hello, Alden. All is well? Uh, not terribly, but good to see you. Hey. Excuse me, Alden. Get on the train. Get your bags, miss. I got this. Come here, Yankee. With pleasure, you goddamn fool. Oh, yeah, here we go. Fight, fight. I come back here without giving you a weapon. We should have done this last time. Yeah. This would have happened. I'll just kick your fucking ass. You one brain between you. You're gonna get hurt, cowboy. Get it, Scott. Oh, yo, is it? One of you hit me, damn it. Come on, Arthur. If that is his real name, I... it doesn't matter. He can fight. family you've got there, son. I know. Charming to the last. Then again, my uncle used to keep his own half-brother as a slave, so what do you expect? Good manners? My uncle used to say things were better the way they were when he could rape and kill with impunity, and he didn't have to work a day in his life. Both our families. There's good people in this county, but our families bullied them and drove most of them off, whites as well as blacks, all over this silly feud. Well, how do I? Oh, my lord. What? Oh, I think it's my second cousin. What is with it with all these goddamn cousins? I think they found out about the jewels. Right, keep your heads down. I'll deal with this. Jewels? Oh, it's cause it's stopping. I have a horse is here. Look! Is that the driver? He's abandoning us! Old tired, alright. I'll take a look up front. What will you do? I'll, I'll figure it out. I'll try. There you did run. Remind me to rob your trains, mister. with the train. 
get to be a train driver, yay! I know he's good, Doctor. Well, hello. What's the ball is this? I was stopped. It's best you go on alone from here. Mr. Arthur, I didn't know you could drive a train. Neither did I. <laughs> but if I'm honest, it was kind of fun. <laughs> and I didn't kill any of us. Well, I killed some of your relatives, but they would have killed all of us. You are a gentleman, sir. <laughs> oh, no, I ain't. Yes, you are. Here, I ain't got much money, but these sapphires are worth a lot of money. Old family heirloom. That Braithwaite treasure. Hmm. <sighs> no, I'll reject. I'll be nice. I couldn't take it. No. Let's get you off to Boston before any more your relatives show up. That might be wise. Hey, you there? Yeah. This couple is heading up north to the Boston line. They got money. They'll pay you on arrival. That work for you? Yeah, sounds fine. Get on in. Hey, uh, you carry protection on a journey like this? <laughs> I wouldn't be much of a stage driver if I didn't. It goes everywhere I do. Hey! <gasps> Miss Braithwaite is going to hold on to this until arrival. Hmm? On account of the treasure on your person. I don't know how to thank you. Uh -huh. You're a fine man, sir. Just get out of here. I'll leave. Yeah! Oh god, no fucking bronze. I don't know how to get better versions. Oh, cool. I've got no mail, apparently. I want to aim the weapon. Hello. You all right there, sir? Yes. Why? Been some grip going around here. And I just thought, uh... Ah, you know what? Never mind. What can I do for you? Apparently I've got some mail. Invitation from mail arrived nine days ago. Once you're Kilgore, it was lovely to make your acquaintance at the residency of the night. You mean so many people at these kinds of functions, it's hard to keep track. I did notice, however, that you were near my study when poor Pierre had an accident and some documents simply disappeared. Now, I spent far too long in politics to make accusations wildly. 
but just long enough to know when I'm owed a small favour. Perhaps your gung-ho frontier spirit and my cold old world cynicism you from around? We get folks could work quite well together. Indulge me in a meeting at least. Come to the back of the mayor's residence any time at night you wish. Knock on the door and my assistant John Merck will let you in. I hope to see you soon, your newest friend, Henry Libby. Okay. Thanks for your assistance. I've got a lot of money. I could probably go. Can I go to the shop? I may. I may want to go clothes shopping. Not that it. I keep opening the fucking social club because it's put. It's de by default. It's paused on the social club. There's a trapper there. Um, I'll go see him quickly. Ah, uh, but then I gotta go all the way over here to Micah. Where is he? Is he up? I think he's up. He's all the way up there! <laughs> I don't want to try that far. Okay, right, let's go sir. see the trapper first. Hello. That's Evan Cross for a while, eh? Good to see you. So, what do you have for me? Okay, let's take a look at it. Hope you make good use of that. Pleasure doing business with you. Thanks for your help. Let's All made to measure. Reinforce holders reduce the amount of maintenance weapons required. I'll take it. Very wise. Oh, some of them have to complete challenges, right. Reinforce offhand hostages reduce the amount of maintenance required. Ever been down in Gap Tooth Ridge? Local legend speaks of a white cougar, Giaguro. Well, it's no legend. I saw it once, for a second. No point chasing. It's gone. That's a nice fest. You want my wares right here's the open place to find them. I thought I could have any of them. Secret or anything, just a, a really big wolf. So you need like perfect skins for most of these. Thank you very much. Thank you for your help. Uh right, I guess we're making the long journey. I could go to Strawberry and hope for the best. Sorry, it's a range for hunting and fishing and supplies, long provisions and green products. And you can use the wheeler, Ross and Co. Newspaper seller, post -up. I'm gonna go to Strawberry and see if I can use that stagecoach because I really do not, I repeat, do not to ride all the way to where my hiker is. Oh 
I gotta help you. Hey, yeah. Let's go see if we can help this guy. Jesus. For, for the blood. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I was done for you. Stay with me. Thank you. <laughs> Take something from my back for the trouble. I'm, uh, <clears throat> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take, take a minute now. <sighs> my leg feels like it's, like it's on fire. I'll have him keep it. Want some whiskey? Here, drink this for the pain. Oh, 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 God, yes. Oh, oh. And, and the thing, I almost didn't bring the trap. Steering trap. Alright, I'll leave you to it. Probably looked at that first. It's actually not too expensive, which is good. We are in Asberg. Well, you know you where to find me. Ride. Where are you going today? Asberg, please. Looks like we'll have a long ride together. Yeah, we do. My horse coming in too? Yes, he is. He's a clever boy. Hey, 
Thank you. Much appreciated. Right, into the country I go, because apparently there's more guns for there. Sorry, I didn't Hello, meet This must Watch be it. your first time. Ah, let's have a look. Oh, semi-auto shotgun. Fires quicker, reloads quicker. Used to be a busy little town in its day. Now I'm the only store still open. If you have gotten tired of staring down the sights on this one, you might want to upgrade them. This will keep you safe. I got money to spend. If any part of this weapon isn't to your like, we can change it right out. Maybe the frame or the barrel. Anything really. I say, can I give it? Oh, I'm going gold. Come on, give me a gold and a shotgun. Conditions in that mine are getting worse by the year. If nobody wants to work there, what would become of this town? Not that I can see it because it's got a fucking thing on it, hasn't it? people in this town are just trying to survive. I like to think I offer tools to help with that. Let's go with that colour. Very nice. Okay, is that taken care of? Dollar thirty five for revolver cartridges. Are oh, they express? Here you go. Mm. Quality gun will save your life many times over. That is what I aim to provide. I get plenty of people coming in just for that. Oh, that looks too bad. Have you considered improving the sights on this weapon? It makes a big difference. We could change any components of this firearm you don't like. The trigger, the hammer, the barrel. I could put some excellent engraving on this if you're interested. I'm a golden gun for God's sake.
If you want to stay another night, the room is still available for you. I'll go with the scorpion. Right, I think that's me sorted. New shotgun, new pistol, well, revolver. I knew there was a big shootout with the Murphy gang in the caves at Beaver Hollow. Thank you. Really? So I got volcanic pistol. Schofield revolver, semi auto shotgun, nothing there. So I can get my horse and actually sort those. You're now hot. What well, hot your health got to change clothes to cool down? Uh, how do I do that? Oh, I just do this, don't I? Ooh, hello! I'll take that. Um. Inside you ain't. I'm just a realist, friend. Micah reckons there's a rat. Oh, does he? On what evidence? He's only back a minute. Pinkerton show up. <laughs> We've been on the run since you two fools went crazy in Blackwater. We barely escaped with our lives in Saint Denis. Now we got a rat. Well, Molly clearly talked, but who else? Maybe we pushed things too hard. Whoa. Maybe time for folks like us is past. <laughs> we don't need a rat. We got sloppier than the town drunk, and they know who we are, and where we are, and what we're doing. The way I see it, the best thing we can do is let the week go. Move on, get our money, and start over. That ain't happening. Well, something's gotta happen, and fast. Otherwise, Cornwall, them Pinkertons, they've got us panned in here. And ain't none of them stopping. Well, Cornwall's why we're here. Shall we, Dutch? Yeah, it's time to go. Let's head to the river. Oh, leave Cornwall alone. He ain't. We need money. But revenge? Now? Of course it's for money. Come on, Arthur. This better not be no stupid revenge mission, Dutch. It ain't worth it. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, Arthur. It's just a simple social call. <laughs> Yeah, I do not trust those two one bit. So, what are we going to say to him that needs to be said? He has been hunting us since Valentine. He is the reason that Hosea got killed. His sugar business is destroying the people of Guarma. This town, Arthur, is his town. He bought it just to destroy these folks. His sugar, his oil, his law. These are wrongs that you can't write, Dutch. We're wanted men. Hmm. So why did you go for John against my wishes? I didn't want him hanged. Neither did I. We're gonna cut a deal, Arthur. 
What are you talking about? <sighs> we want out, and Cornwall wants us to stop robbing him, and we all know his money is what's keeping the Pinkertons on our tail. He's America. Gee, what happened the last time we tried to talk out. a deal? Oh yeah, I got kidnapped and He'll tortured. Let us go. This ain't making a lot of sense, Dutch. It will, son. It, it will. will. A deal, some noise, and then we're gone. We did this before, it did not end well. I was beaten to a pulp, if you remember. Dutch. Boat is due in soon. Let's get down here behind these crates. Oh yeah, if there's only wants to talk a deal, yeah, hiding. Will you get out of sight? <sighs> I bought myself some cherry coke from work, so stuck in the freezer for an hour. It's nice well, and cold. Thank you for your hospitality, Mr. Cornwall. This was a business meeting, Mr. Milton. We are not friends. I have spent a considerable fortune with your agency and still nothing. This Vanderlyn robs me and laughs at me. I asked for the best. I paid for the best. We are very close, Mr. Cornwall. I know you've heard this before. Can't, sir. Send a telegram to Goldberg in New York. Tell him I won't borrow Goldberg. more than 3.2%. Are Sorry, we next? No, I have heard it before. It's a wrestling Get reference. Get that army man to pay his portage charge. Yes, sir. We are doing all we can within the confines of the law. The law? I think we both know what you can do with your law. Find me Dutch Vanderland. Bring him here. And leave the laws to them as need them. Good day, sir. Come along, Mr. Ross. We have work to do. Mr. Didsbury. Mr. Cornwall. Now listen up, Didsbury. What's all this about strikes? I bought into this mine because of mismanagement. And I intend to make it a success no matter what the cost. It's the wages. Folk feel Folk that you... feel? Business doesn't give two figs about feelings, sir. Not two figs. It's a nonsense that will bring a plague on both our houses, sir. Perhaps there is a plague on your house already, Mr. Cornwall. What do you want, sir? I'm not quite sure just yet. Your impudence will be your undoing, sir. I'm undone already. Even my best friend here, he thinks I'm crazy. And like this poor fellow you are talking to, my feelings are hurt. You robbed me, sir. And you robbed him. Funny world. You show a criminal's grasp of sophistry, sir. I did no such thing. You kill. I kill. You rob. I rob. Only difference I can see is I choose whom I kill and rob and you destroy everything in your path. I've heard just about enough. I'll tell you what. You give me this ship, $10,000, and take passage out of here, I'll let you live. <laughs> I'll do no such thing! <laughs> you sure? Good. Yeah. I prefer it this way. Of course. Yep. That laughter to himself, you know he's fucking losing it. Right, let's try this new one out. What'd you expect? Oh, it's such a powerful one. Yes! This may be my new favorite gun. Uh, I'm very excited to try a shotgun at some point. Don't you get out of the way. Oh, hello, Michael. I found something interesting. Come on, we got a 
Don't mind me, just rubbing this casual body. I'll take whatever you got. I'm coming, I'm coming. Stay with me, Arthur. I'm coming. Arthur, come on. I'm coming. Cornwall's men are all over the place. Follow me and stay close. We had enough meat on us before. Now we're gonna be torched. This is the only way. No, no it's not. I just love how powerful these two guns are. I mean, because you only wanted the boat. Let's go. Well, at least we tried talking it out. Boys, lost your minds. Oh, I felt a lot of guilt in this life, Arthur. I've killed too often and poorly, but not this time, son. Come on. <laughs> All right, let's head for the hills, boys. Try not to hit the tree. Okay. Ah, I mean, shot. God, but you could take your shots. Jesus. He was down in one. Look out, fellas! They're still coming! Shoot the bastard! Oh. Like we now, Don't say that. Baby. Just, I feel like that's like a really old trope in a game now. Oh! Whoops, I'm running off the wall. Sorry, I'd love to wait for a second to uh, look at the laptop. Well, we all okay? No. Interesting social call. No, oh, don't play dumb and superior at the same time, Morgan. We all knew sooner or later Cornwall had to go. Let me see them papers. It's more attention we don't need. Feels like the whole world's closing in on us. Dutch. It won't be long before they find where we're hiding out now. Especially as we ain't exactly hiding now. We just need a distraction. Buy us some time. It looks like Mr. Cornwall's company has signed a railroad contract with the Army. And they're also moving dynamite down from, well, the Annisburg mines to San Denis to resell. And there's bonds at his oil factory. Maybe there's a way to get them off our back and get the money that we need. Mike, you look into this dynamite. Take Bill, I guess, Arthur. You go, too. We are gonna need a lot of it. And, Mike, we need to talk. Figure out some things. Of course, boss. Figure out what? The plan. Getting out of here. Nothing's changed. It hasn't, huh? There's an old house west of Van Horn. Meet me there when you can, Black Lung. Let's split up. We'll meet up back at camp. Yeah. This is crazy. 
Oh, we really aren't well. Look at that face. We are not well. Oh, another fucking bronze. Right. Oh, yeah, boy. I can see you here in the distance. Oh, I'm glad I got new guns, though. What time are we on? Hour 23. Ah, uh, I can do... Do one more. What we got? Reverend Swanson. Wants to speak to us. That's the my question. Uh, right, let's do the Reverend one. Do you realize I actually weren't that far away from the thing? Me okay there, boy? Mister? He's watching. He's always watching. Yeah. He's never talking. They won't forgive you. Uh -uh. They, they, they didn't forgive me. There is no forgiveness. None, friend. None. Well, I, I know you want it. I can smell it on you. <laughs> Well, it didn't happen. No, 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 it didn't. <laughs> that's why, that, that, that's why uh, I'm out here well away from them. See, they come for me, but I'm watching. Yeah. I, I never sleep. I never do. Okay. I was something. I'm just gonna uh, take these plants. Bedrock root is stamina herb. It can be used to refill your stamina core or cut it into bitters. I like how he says he never sleeps yet. Let's go see what Swanson wants. Challenging times for all of us. Yes, very challenging. You don't seem yourself somehow. I, I've always felt. I've left the morphine, sir. Oh, I'm in Reverend Swanson, would you excuse us a minute? Of course. New York. We are going to go to New York. Now, they have been chasing us south and east and west. We're going to get a boat. We're going to get on a river. And we're going to go north. New York. Then Tahiti, the Fiji Islands, or this place, New Guinea, dancing girls, freedom. But first, we have to make a whole lot of smoke, a whole lot of commotion. And then we disappear. We need more commotion. One score and one whole hell of a lot of noise. We ain't so good at doing scores anymore, Dutch. Are you feeling all right, Arthur? Sure, I'm fine. Pardon me for interrupting. I brought a friend, Arthur. Hello. Hello. Dutch. This is Eagle Flash. His father is a great chief. Charles and I, we um, pretended to be mercenaries. Did me a great favor. Dutch Van Nguyen. 
How do you do? Not well, sir. Well, I am sorry to hear that. How's your father? Father is confused. Wisdom with weakness. His people, my people. We've suffered too much. Been lied to too much. Now they've taken our horses. Who? The infantry division posted at Fort Wallace. Why? Colonel Favors is a liar and a murderer. His people won't stop until we're all dead. Without horses, we cannot hunt. Without hunting, we will starve. This is another act of war. I see that. Men have helped me before, and I have money. Put your money away, son. What do you think, Charles? You know I told your father I will not fight over some horses. But I made no such promise. Come along. Yeah, Arthur, we must go with them. To try to stop things from getting out of hand. I guess. Come on. Oh, that does look like shit now, doesn't he? Oh, the, the TV's really getting to... <laughs> we can just get the more horses. Horses? I know. I understand Eagle Flies is angry, but I don't see how this will help anything. Especially not with Dutch whipping them up into a frenzy. We've got enough folks coming after us without having an army going Let this. Let these bastards walk all over you? No, you're not. This is all that's wrong with this world. Okay, young man, lead the way. The horses are on the boat near Van Horn. I have a man waiting for us there with some canoes. Surely this can be done without killing anyone. Of course. What will be will be. Anyway, son, tell me about this Colonel Favors. He's a vile man. He and his regiment take the pleasure of persecuting us. All the young have been taken from our reservation, shipped off to reform schools. Many women, too. The older are weak and sick, but they deliberately withhold medicine and supplies from us. This ends today. You have my word on that. Dutch might be the uh, political tyrant again. Why are you getting involved in this, Dutch? You know me. We shoot fellers as need shooting. We save fellers as need saving. Feed them as need feeding. This again. It's been quite a while since we helped anyone but ourselves. Even you know that. I told you. Noise. We need noise, Arthur. Noise and faith. I still don't know what that means. Stop questioning and think. Just think for a second. The Pickertons have had time to reinforce. The civilized world is closing on us. Who knows what else Molly told them? We need to move towards the conclusion now. Sure, but what's this got to do with any of that? Some good, honest conflict between the army and the Indians might be just the distraction we need. Kill two birds with one stone. Cornwall was funding the Pinkertons' assault on us. Why do you think I dealt with him? With Cornwall gone, the government is far more likely to divert them to other issues, especially if there's one more scandal. And then we can slip away. Like I said, we just need that noise and one more score. You know, I went back for the chest I had hidden outside Shady Bell, and we're close, Arthur. That's dynamite. The railroad contract with the army, it was all in those papers Micah found. I have a plan. You just have to trust me. There's Peta. His men, like I said. They'll help us. I got the canoes. The boat is still moored in the channel. Good. Let's wait until nightfall. All right. We can set out.
There we go. All good. We need to get that boat ashore. I think the best plan is to paddle up there silently, border. And when we got control, we'll deal with that anchor, float away. <laughs> we'll be ashore before anybody even knows what happened. So are we just stealing these boats? Because if the horses are on the boats, how are we getting them off? Pull up alongside. Quietly. Try not to kill anyone, Arthur. Oh, okay. I need smoke. Oh! No, not again. <laughs> Good head all night. I'll be retired in the morning at this rate. Just deal with it. I'm in. Crazy. We can go higher than that. Take it back, what's ours? Don't push the We need to round them up. I'll get these four, Arthur. Can you go after the others? Okay. Over here, come on. Careful. You got a problem with that horse? Whoa. 
There we go. Seems like Uncle Sam likes you fellas even less than he likes us. So it goes. My father doesn't want to fight again. Will one of you help me return the horses to my men? Well, Arthur... Oh, Arthur needs to rest. I will. I like you, son. And after the horses, are we going to wait for the army to come and wreak its revenge? I hope not. Of course we ain't. Now let's go check out that fort of theirs. Is this a good idea? This is the only idea. And it is one that will suit both of our purposes. Fighting the army ain't wise. Stop worrying. Oh, and Sadie told me about Combe. Meet us at Doyle's Tavern in San Denis when you can. Shall we go, son? Certainly. We'll start some light reconnaissance out of Fort Wallace, and when Combe's dealt with, you come meet us there. We'll set up a good spot for you. I don't know, Dutch. Yeah, well, I do. This is exactly the distraction that we need. Your father said that fighting was an impossible gamble. There's no winning for you in this. Your father need not know anything. He'd rather live in ignorance. Come along, Captain. Your father would rather you did not do anything so foolish. I said I would stop this from happening. Would you talk to him? We could arrange for Yes. Would you? May I go? Sure. Oh. I'll speak with him. You get on back to camp, check on the others, touch his behaviors. I understand. Thank you, Arthur. Gold! A rage unleashed, I got gold! Uh, I tell you what, I am probably going to wrap up there good hour 40 minutes um a lot of missions have popped up haven't they Wait, hang on i've got the map button uh so there's the mica there's a stranger ignoring stranger sadie in town uh rain's fall up here Couple more strangers. That's the camp. Did another one pop up? I thought there's four. I guess there's only three. But yeah, um So uh we have I'll tell you what, let's see how much we've actually done. So fifty one point one run before. It must be about fifty three, fifty four now. Fifty two point seven, okay. Um yeah, uh, Dutch seems to be going more insane. He's just gone and killed um, Cornwall after the whole drama of the first part of the story. Um, managed to get John out of prison, which was good, but then that pissed Dutch off because it wasn't to his plan. Uh, uh, we're going to go talk to Rainsfall in the next stream. Um, and then we'll do the other missions. Uh, that would be tomorrow night. Maybe the like I would say the afternoon, but I like I said, I've probably got plans for the afternoon. The reason I tend to stream at night is because then I know that like there's barely gonna be an interruption, and it's not gonna be not like as important, but you know what I mean. Where it's like it's not gonna be like a phone call or someone going, "Hey, do you want to go do something?" Um, like I'm not gonna get that at, like one in the morning, so that's why I can't do it now. But uh, thank you very much for watching this uh, YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Xbox, PlayStation. They're all rbillington94. Twitch.tv forward slash rbillington. That's where I do my streams. All these will be going on to uh, YouTube. I can't remember if I uploaded last night's one. Uh, if not, I will definitely make sure to do that. I'm pretty sure I did. Um, but yeah. 
Uh, sorry, I'm good. Sleepy. Um, yeah, like I said, thank you very much for watching these. Uh, um, I'm very grateful for any people that do watch them on either platform. Uh, thank you for the new follower that I had from yesterday because I'm up to 52 now. Uh, like I said, I'm going to try and keep it going. There's probably another two weeks or so of this going on. Uh, so around mid-May, there may be a new game I'll start streaming. Uh, we shall see. But uh, like I said, thank you very much for watching this, and I'll hopefully see you in the next one.